Maintaining your posture throughout the swing is very important. Today we're going to talk about how to maintain that posture throughout your swing. So maintaining your posture throughout your swing has a massive effect on your swing plane and your swing path. If you, if you lose your posture throughout the swing, you can see how your shoulders become a bit more level, your backside comes into the golf ball, and you're swinging the golf club so tend to be on a, on, a, on a slightly more flatter plane. Generally speaking, what goes up must come down, so I see, do see a lot of people come over the top as they try and get back down to the back down to the golf ball, back down to, down into posture, impact posture. But one of the main things I do see from people when they do this is that they stay there and they get locked. This hip becomes locked uh, on the downswing and you, and you swing from in to, to out and you produce a little bit of a block. I probably like a lot of people do lose my posture and uh, it's one of my traits that I do I'm always looking at um, all the time it's, it's like the nemesis that always bites me back if I am playing badly my I tend to just raise up a little bit on the back swing why I do it probably it's a little bit easier you know we you know twist it's a little bit difficult you know you'll get a little bit lazy lift it up and also the feeling is when you lift it up, you get a bit of a power lift. You, oh, I'm gonna, gonna hit it a little bit further, but obviously that's not gonna be the case. So, what I've got to maintain is, you know, you maintain your, your posture throughout the swing um, will help you deliver the golf ball, you know, square, and then it also you get your angles of attack correct uh, to the to the what I would refer to as the chair drill. Uh, many tutors throughout the world do utilize this drill uh, for their pupils. So taking a household chair, a folding chair, anything, put your, your bum against it, address the golf ball and make sure that your backside or you know the, 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 the top of your legs is, like the, is here, is touching that chair. The wrong way of doing it when we lose the posture is we come this way and you can see that my backside is moved away from that chair that's wrong we don't want that to happen we want to maintain essentially the line that your bottom's creating here so what we feel of is this this right bum cheek is maintaining contact with that chair you can maintain to contact with that chair you can see now that my spine angle is tilted forwards. I'm in a really good backswing position. We're wound up really well. You can feel the power in your right thigh. And that sets yourself into a really good position to deliver the golf ball, sorry, the golf club to the golf ball. So just recap on that one. As you take it away, you feel that you're you push or maintain that connection with that left, sorry, the right bum cheek against that chair. That will help you maintain your posture in the backswing. If you do, if you are um, going to do this drill, do it steady to start off with. You know, don't want any injuries. The reason why you lose your spine angle is probably because you've got a little bit of stiffness. Um, your flexibility issues um, in your midsection. So I don't want any injuries. I want you to take it nice and steady, go through it nice and slow like I just done there. You can build up to, to swing it a little bit faster, but I would never do it at any, any form of speed because when I do change my golf swing, I have always take it steady. I always really go slow. I want to feel the movements. I don't want just to just practice. I want to you make sure that it's quality practice. So incorporate it into your practice if you need to. Thank you very much for watching. Um, if you have a, a light, 
what you've seen today, give us a, a big like, thumbs up. There is a link below. If you get to subscribe, please do so. I know um, if you have already subscribed, thank you very much. I ask every time. Um, but if you do want to subscribe, please do so. There's a bell next to it. If you press the bell, any new content that we put out, will you will be notified. Comments are always greatly appreciated. Your feedback is much appreciated by, by myself, you know, to help me get better in the videos or to put in different content that, that you want to see. So, good practice. I hope you're safe and well. And I'll, I look forward to seeing you back at the golf club in the not too distant future. Thank you.